I went over to the, the Arizona to see if I could see this guy. He was a friend of mine. I hadn't seen him for years. But he never showed up. But about that time, the, the planes came in and started bombing us. I seen the planes coming. We all seen the planes coming. And you could see them drop the torpedoes. And they was coming right straight at our sides. And when the Arizona, when they, when they hit the Arizona with the big bombs, he blew up like a, a balloon from the inside, just boom. And I was blown over the side into the water. Then I get onto this boat. By the time I got there, there was a lot of other guys on it. But I was the only one that knew how to run that boat because that's what was my job. So I got it started and I headed for the Liberty Dock. And when I got to the Liberty Dock to let these guys off, they jumped off. About that time, here came the planes that had dropped their bombs and their torpedoes. And they came back around the harbor. And as they was, these guys was going to safety, they machine gunned them along the dock. I was going to get off, too. But when I seen that, I said, what's the use? I just got in the boat and took off again. I kept going. And every time you go somewhere, well, you'd run into some bodies, so you'd pick them up and take them back. The first day, it was a lot of survivors. I don't know. Who knows? I, I took them to the island. They'd jump off the boat, and that would be, I never heard from any of them. Nobody had time enough to know what was going through their mind. It happened that fast. Now, you, you people think I'm a lion about it, but from the time the first bomb hit till seven minutes later, it was all over. In fact, my think, uh, I think my brain was numb for about 12, 14 hours. I didn't even remember where the hell I was or what I was doing. And I thought there was nothing in the world that could do anything in one of those ships. All built out of iron, heavy, big, all kinds of everything that would go on them. No way anybody could do anything to this. But in seven minutes, they practically wiped us out. Well, I think what you can learn from Pearl Harbor is what they say. Remember Pearl Harbor. Don't get overconfident that you can control the world or what you want to do. Just like, like right now, they're, they're very confident of what power they got. But how do we know what the other guys got?